This segment of Hack 5 is brought to you by The Ben Heck Show. So check this out. Last night I ran into John McCoy who has these ridiculous laser hands. Yes, that's right. Laser gloves. <laughs> and they're lasers that are controlled on each individual finger. Yes. And so where did this come about? Uh, this was just kind of a fun project back in the day when we were going to college. Me and my friend were kicking around the ideas. It was his passion. And he just kept running with it. And now laser hands. <laughs> And so what, what exactly are these, these laser guys here? Uh, these are five milliwatt green lasers and uh, they're driven off of a battery pack on your arm and tried to make it feel as natural as possible to have lasers on your fingers. And they come in multiple colors. Uh, blue and red are also really good and custom built and heading towards production. So I'm not really familiar with um, with lasers all that much as far as like the wattage and whatnot. So is five milliwatt really high? Um, five milliwatt is still in that legal range. And oh, there's a legal range. Yes. And if there wasn't a legal range, then no, it wouldn't be high. But um, compared to like a laser pointer you'd find at a store, it's fairly high. And these are a little higher quality than you would find at a, a normal store. And they're um, infrared cutoff. And so you can cut the laser off in the infrared and then have only the pure spectrum and have five milliwatt pure spectrum coming out. So they're higher than five milliwatt, but there's only five milliwatt coming out because it's cut off. Yeah, so, so explain that to me. So you're saying that there's uh, an infrared spectrum that comes out of here as well yeah yeah and that that infrared spectrum we don't see and appreciate and and it also hurts the eyes and that's why there's a five milliwatt cutoff oh so you're saying you can shine this in someone's eyes and it's not going to kill them yeah yeah it'll annoy them after the fourth time i'm sure well i mean this is perfect for like raves and djing and everything but i can totally see like how you know dangerous it could potentially be and also like how fantastically bright they were you could see the beams in the sky to for like you know 50 feet up and that's insane yeah yeah and yeah we were looking at it and yeah it was uh it was a little foggy here and like it was like having a lightsaber for like five six hundred feet like straight yeah and it was kind of like seeing cats like have lasers and now it's like people have lasers. Okay, so explain to me, uh, does, the, does the color of them have anything to do with the, the brightness or how does that work? Yeah, the, the perception of it. Like um, purple is higher on the spectrum and so it doesn't seem as bright, but blue and red are more easily seen. So the perception, yeah. Okay, cool. Well, what about the gloves? So this is these are your friends over at Trinary uh, uh, Products dot com, and they're this is like just a proof of concept build. Um, it started out that way, and more and more sales kept happening. So it's a de facto production model. <laughs> nice. And so this is how is this all powered, and how do you recharge this? What kind of like battery life do you get out of it? Yeah. Um, on your arm is a custom battery pack. You plug it in uh, three, four hours, charge it up, and then battery packs in between usually I would five hour, four or five hours and throw a couple of battery packs on there and you can just swap it out real quick and keep going all night long. And two of them, of course. And yeah. Yeah. That is, that is awesome. What's your mobility like with these on there? Uh, Excellent. Like after the first, I would say like 10 seconds, it pretty much feels normal. Like here you are. Yeah. It's just like motorcycle gloves. Oh, with okay. So yeah, they are like motorcycle gloves and there's actually like a wire under the glove. Yeah. And that takes oh, the power up hey. your arm. Yeah. It doesn't feel that weird, right? Yeah. No, not at all. Yeah. <laughs> Let me plug this uh, in. Which way does it go? So red on the red side. There we go. Cool. Yep. And I'm getting cyborged. <laughs> With lasers on the fingers. Uh. Oh, nice. See? Like, okay, so, so how do I turn, how do we control turning them on and off? Uh, there's a neodymium battery here, and then there's another one that completes a circuit up on the top of your finger here. 
So, so I just touch them. Yeah, a uh, little. Is, yeah, oh. there it is. Oh, uh, so so this is temporary holding them off, and then I let go, and it goes back to the on position. Yeah, and uh, see, it feels like it takes a little bit to get your brain to map to you're controlling something way out there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like I feel like I am Lacutus of Borg. We will assimilate you. We. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know why. This is just very, very enjoyable. Hang on. Yeah. yeah. No, it, it hurts, too. <laughs> yeah. Dude, thanks so much, John. This is ridiculous. Where can people find this stuff? And, and also, where can people find your .NET security research? Uh, these are at uh, trinaryproducts.com. Uh, green is $600. And, yeah, custom high-quality lasers. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, my security research over at... Uh, digitalbodyguard.com and upcoming.netexploit.com upcoming.netexploit ooh I like that we're gonna have to talk about that later I will be in your workshop sounds fantastic man really appreciate it ah, ah, oh yeah there we go cyborg meets human <laughs> or high five there we go and I loved your workshop by the way awesome oh thank you yeah. thank you Join modding wizard Ben Heck and friends as they build and modify a host of amazing community-inspired creations. Be sure to watch new episodes of The Ben Heck Show every two weeks right here at revision3.com slash tbhs. In the latest episode of The Ben Heck Show, Ben builds some portable solar-powered items that might be useful on a camping trip, a phone charger and a rotisserie for cooking bratwurst. Also, Ben is starting a new promotion in this episode. If viewers can spot the Ben Heck bobblehead in the background somewhere in the episode, they can register to win an exclusive grand prize. Go to element14.com slash tbhs to find out all the details.